I want to give you the review of machine learning course which course is better so I currently did the machine learning course from Coursera this website so if you go to the number of courses okay you will get uh, Coursera EDX moved but there is a number of courses also you can see I'm not sponsoring any course from my side uh, it is not my I will not take responsibility for that. I'm not sponsoring any course, but I'm giving my review and expressions what were the things I learned from the internet and which course is better. So before that I have uh, some experience and guess up in some neural networks and machine learning data science domains. Uh, so after suggesting one of my friend, he told me to take this course of machine learning, particularly by Stanford University and course. So it's taught by Indro NG. So I did this course. So you can see the rating of this course is 4.9 out of 5. So in my opinion also, I like this course too much, too much because the way of expression, way of teaching, way of theoretical explanation is very, very good. So it is my opinions, but one of the things there, whatever the in machine learning course, whatever I mean completed, that is made in very older days, in 2013 around. Uh, 2011 at uh, 2011 or 13 around by the way but the popularity of this course is still not great there is a total 11 week course and there is a total 9 week assignment and each and every week have a quiz so you should have to pass this course by submitting the assignment very properly and uh, by submitting the quiz but I want to mention here whatever the assignment is given in this program the assignment all the assignment here in MATLAB see it is my assignment of week 8 week 9 it is in MATLAB so most of the function is there uh, already com computed just main thing you should have to write the code for that so and you can online submit the solutions to the server okay by the way now i'm coming back to the another courses along with that of machine learning course i love this course too much so along with that you can take another courses like i will next suggest you to go to that course developers.google.com so it's the google machine learning crash course this course also very good understanding each of the uh, there are this much of video is there and uh, lecture series is there so you can learn a lot from this course This one is also very good. I I, I realize this thing So you can choose this thing also machine learning crash course So along with that analytical with also there so essential machine learning algorithm with Python and R course Some of the people also like this course. Okay. It is your opinion your choice which course will like because some of the people like some instructor but he or she is not very favorite to me so it is dependent upon so you can go through this course also it's free of cost but in yeah in machine learning that course of course error is 50 dollars now it is in indian i mean near about 4000 something so if you pay for the amount i think it is not worth of your money so after that we'll come to the another things here this one also goods this one is the open ml open ml from their number of data number of already project assignment those who did you can explain the project expand the project from your side you can follow this website also very good open ml for machine learning you can go through that website scikit-learn.organization is the scikit learn website from there also you can learn the classification regression clustering dimensional reduction model solution processing those are the things this one also very good but i told number of guys like number of website number of uh, different different instructor so depend upon you so i will suggest you go through all of them first browse them give one hour at least after that take the decisions which one will do but do not shift from one course to another course one course to another course like this way and the way of teaching um when we will teach something we will take a note from your side and 
try to keep the remember all the equations it's very good not form in logical i will repeat the sentence again try to remember all the equation not only in logical this is a very important when you go for interview or when you will take the interview i believe that most of the guy know this machine learning and data science all the other thing but if you ask him or her a very deep question from equations or for expression or graphical representation is unable to give the answer proper answer so along with that i will you can follow this one also this is i found in uh, this one also quite good not so bad so you can go for that also so i did the machine learning course from course there i realized that this course is very good so whatever the assignment is there so all the assignment i uploaded it in youtube so there is no problems that there is no problem that uh, all the informations all the coding to help you will get from the youtube see i already have uploaded machine learning 9 week 8 week 7 week all the things uploaded here so feel free to comment me to reach out me to get the code okay we'll get these things no problem so see my last video all the code is uploaded here it is the first time me only that i uploaded the machine learning course uh, all the assignment solutions in uh, all the assignment solution in youtube so i will suggest you one more thing please like subscribe and share my videos and it will motivates me and very soon i will try to approach for the solutions there is machine learning solutions and for coding explanatory ex Ex, uh, explanations with the proper theoretical knowledge to, with the language of R and Python, because it is trending in the company standard or company requirement. So I want just uh, changing the programming skill knowledge switch from MATLAB to R or Python. So this is the machine learning overview, but I will. recommended you that whatever you choose you will go for that but you can take the course from edx also but the charge is quite high is that quite quite uh, i mean not uh, so i mean for a intermediate family it is not so much not i mean it is too much for us so if you want uh, with the very cheap money or the less money we will good course then we will can go for this and there there is a lot of resources also in internet you will learn from anywhere it is not a problem so this is the review of that so in the course in a uh, really i want to suggest whatever the thing to be learned from the course let me just uh, browse one one or two things that we'll learn from there first is things we'll learn from the what is machine learning and machine learning proper definition of arthur samuel and tom michael most of the i don't know what is machine learning machine learning proper definitions and second we will learn linear regression in complete view i am very sure about that after that we will uh, in third week we will learn those things in a complete manner logistic regression is a very important skill classification and the presentations logistic presentations model and then followed by you will learn regularizations underfit overfit multi class classifications in the fourth bias and various problem how to trade up the bias and various problem then the neural network the forward propagation and neural network back propagations why we are using the neural network and then support vector machine and then support vector machine and uh, first week you will learn the gradient dis gradient descent cost function how to optimize the cost function how to uh, detect the values of uh, theta and second to Uh, which are how to apply the machine learning and how to apply the machine learning machine learning system the design skewing data set how will handle it how how you will deal with the large scale data set from several learning to obviously will learn from the large scale classification is very good carnell svm uh, then the um, pcm principal component analysis uh, dimensionality deduction those are the thing we broadly discover in this course so i think you will love with this if you go for that it will not the worth of your money so it's only those things in in my opinion so after completion of the course what you will get
obviously we will get the experience you will get complete theoretical knowledge along with that you will get this one online certification from Coursera as I did have certification date of when I completed it my name with paper number and this signature and the certification license number which you know, license number you, you purchase certification number and verify at Coursera they will give the license number with that in the track ID of there so it is all about the various machine learning and machine learning courses so i think if you understand if you have any query or question you can reach out me through the my gmail or the comment box below before that i will suggest you again please like share and subscribe my channel and videos thank you have a good day bye